oil cake. So let's get started. What you'll need is one avocado, one fourth cup cilantro, about two tablespoons of lime juice. You'll need some garlic. I use about two cloves. Um, you'll need about half a teaspoon of onion powder. You'll need half a teaspoon of parsley. You'll need one eighth teaspoon of paprika. And you'll be, need about one half teaspoon of awesome Italian seasoning, which is optional. You'll need about six tablespoons of nutritional yeast, which this gives off a wonderful cheesy flavor, if that's what you're looking for. You'll need three tablespoons of uh, liquid aminos. And then we'll need about three tablespoons of balsamic vinegar, which is going to be our oil replacement. And then we'll need about two tablespoons of milled flax seeds and about a one-fourth cup of cold water. And all of this is going to go all together inside of this wonderful food processor. And I might add some black pepper as well. So we'll see how it comes out when we get it all together. All right, we have everything inside of the food processor, as you can see. It doesn't look flattering, but we're going to give this a few spins and see what the consistency looks like. All right, guys, it's done. Let's see what this looks like. Uh looks all right you know looks not that pleasing but it tastes really good so if you're making this from scratch find yourself a container and I'm using an old um, what do you call it the uh, crystal light containers I washed it and cleaned it and labeled it put the date so we know you know when we made it and it's gonna go in here and that's what we're gonna be using for the week it has a nice little lid and it's good to go One thing you'll definitely need in your cabinets is seasonings. As you can see, I have quite a bit. Most of these came from uh, from the bulk section, and it's anywhere from like sesame seeds to nutritional yeast, chili powder, cinnamon, because they be, they're actually a little bit cheaper when you buy them in bulk. Um, I also have your standard seasonings that you would see like garlic, salt, paprika, um, onion powder. I have this awesome um, aromatic herbal salt which um, I've tried in my soup and it came out really good fajita seasoning which I use on my tofu um, you know Southwest Chipotle by Mrs. Dash and also when you're making meals you want to have liquid aminos which is a plant-based uh, soy sauce and also a uh, like a salt alternative I also have garlic wine vinegar which I use in um, my dressings and over here are some of the um, oils that I had in the past. I mean, I might use them from time to time when I'm cooking like uh, stir fry. I have different vinegars, you know, balsamic vinegar, red wine vinegar. I have wok oil back there. Um, I have vegan Worcestershire sauce, some rice vinegar, um, some apple cider vinegar, and some agave. And these things really do come in hand when you're cooking awesome vegan recipes. So if you have any questions about certain herbs and seasonings that I use, just leave a comment below and I'll tell you what I have and what I use on a regular basis. Have a good one.